I'm happy as hell to have Big Mark Gasol, uh, who Laker Nation, first of all, know that he was traded on draft day for his older brother. Yeah, he was, he's supposed to be a Laker. Do you think Powell's coming Laker. out? Do you think Powell's coming back? We see. <laughs> we see. Maybe, I mean, we'll see. Uh, yeah, we'll see. So, you know, happy to have uh, Mark, another champion. Yeah. Yep. One with the Raptors two years ago, who I've always loved. Yeah. Mark has my Defensive Player of the Year trophy at his house. But... <laughs> Yo, but, I, but, 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 but that's no hero there. I, no, 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 that's not but, a knock on Mark, but I, this is the thing. Because, like, you know, sometimes we don't pay attention. I love you, attention. Mark. I, can't wait, to, I can't wait to talk about this. We Wesley Matthews, who yeah. I've loved to compete Great against. Guy. And his father is a former Laker as well. Oh, that's dope. So we got two guys. Trez. We got two guys who have family Laker ties. Yep. And then we get Trez. I'll Trez it. <laughs> Now we got Trez. Well, how Trez ended up here with we the knocked on it. We knocked on it. So Trez was the next door neighbor. Six man of the year. First of all, Trez was the next door neighbor. We knocked on his door and said, uh, do you like Yeah, he said he felt like the right Clippers didn't like what was going on. How did Trez end up with We knocked on his door the and we landed Trez. I mean, the That was honestly like the moment of free agency where everyone was like, what? Yeah. Yeah, including, including some of his teammates. That they, they actually put that on social media. That's not like I'm making it up. He said, what? <laughs> we got Trez, who six man of the year award winner who's going to help our bench, which we, we struggled with our, this past year with our bench, you know, and keeping that up. And then... Then <laughs> you got the runner-up. And then we got the runner-up, six man of the year award, and Dennis Schroeder, so who... That was a pickup. Who I call his nickname. He might, I don't know if you like it or not. We have not had the conversation, but he's Dennis the Menace. Dennis the Menace. Because I love what nickname. he brings to the game, his tenacity. He's a dog. You got to let him go. He gets under the skin. He's a Richard Jefferson, Draymond Green type guy where... <laughs> If he's your teammate, you love the shit out of him. If he's not, you can't stand him. So ito nga si Lebron ay pinag-usapan ng kanyang mga bagong teammate dito sa Los Angeles Lakers. Ang interview na nga ito ay ginanap sa Spectrum Sportsnet na channel. At ang tawag nga sa show nila ay Road Trippin. Tapos ang nagmamayari sa show na to ay Uninterrupted, which is kumpanya rin ni Lebron. Inumpisa niya nga ito at ng kanyang business partner na si Maverick Carter. Ito nga ay parang platform sa mga NBA player at sa lahat ng mga atlet. So parang nagpo-podcast sila at mga interview pagdating dito sa mga show sa Uninterrupted. Pero anyways, ang training camp nga ay mag-uumbisa na bukas, December 1, sa ibang bansa. So December 2 ito sa atin. mag na ang NBA training camp at malapit na rin mag ang NBA sa December 22, American Time. So halos tatlong linggo na lang ay babalik na nga muli ang NBA at makikita na natin ang mga bagong team. Itong Los Angeles Lakers, ang Brooklyn Nets at ng iba pang mga exciting na team. So bago pa nga magkumpisa ang mga training camp, syempre nagpa-practice na rin ang mga NBA players sa kanilang mga teams. Si Montrez Harrell, palagi nga siya nag story sa kanyang Instagram at nagpa-practice nga siya sa Los Angeles Lakers training facility. At syempre pati na rin ang mga ibang NBA players ay nag-uumpisa ng mag-practice. So balik na tayo dito sa interview dito. So mukhang napaka-excited na nga ni Lebron pagdating sa kanyang mga bagong teammate. Parang gusto niya na umbisa na agad ng season. Dahil itong ang team na to ay parang pinaka-stack o yung best team nga so far ni Lebron sa kanyang karir. Gumawa nga tayo ng video niyan. At kung gusto niyo na panoorin, nandyan lang yan sa ating channel. Tingnan niyo na lang. So napaka-stack nga ng team ni Lebron ngayong taon. Nasa kanya ang 6 man of the year. na si Montrez Harrell at pati na rin ang runner-up sa Six Man of the Year which is etong si Dennis Schroeder at kung hindi nyo alam mas maraming puntos ang in-score ni Dennis Schroeder kaysa kay Montrez Harrell off the bench at nanalo nga lang si Montrez Harrell ng award ngayon dahil mas maraming panalo ang kanyang team na Los Angeles Clippers at ang former Defensive Player of the Year kasama niya rin na si Mark Gasol So kung hindi nyo alam ang storya behind Lebron saying na yung Defensive Player of the Year na award niya daw ay nasa bahay ni Mark Gasol dahil noong 2013 si Gasol nga ang nanalo. Kaso siya ay nasa second team All-NBA pagdating sa depensa. Second team siya tapos si Lebron naman first team All-Defense pero si Mark Gasol pa rin ang nanalo. So parang nakakalito ba diba? First team All-Defense si Lebron, hindi nanalo ng Defensive Player of the Year. Tapos ito namang si Mark Gasol, second team All-Defense. Tapos siyang nanalo. So magulo. Kaya nga, ganun ang nasabi ni Lebron. Pero anyways, ito nga si Lebron James ay mukhang ready na at excited na makipaglaro sa kanyang mga bagong teammate. At sa kanyang bagong team. So kayo ba guys, excited na ba kayong mapanood itong bagong team ng Los Angeles Lakers? Comment down below kung ano bang saloobin nyo at anong nararamdaman nyo tungkol dito sa Los Angeles Lakers. 
So anyways, yun lamang. If you guys like the video, make sure to like the video. And if you're not subscribed, syempre mag-subscribe na. Dahil everyday meron tayong NBA update. So yun lamang. See you guys next video. Bye.